so that's why i joined and i re- i'm really enjoying this because uh, to be honest with you that there is a less stress comparatively it sector and all so i can manage a job and also i can manage my youtube channel and also i can manage my other stuff i i have heard about that that this kind of jobs are getting bored over time you will not find any time to relax and that's why i didn't want to join there when new things i never i come across mm. i always remain curious to learn to know about the things so this is one of the reasons that uh, once i got to know about you i saw your some of the channel i saw your some of the uh, these uh, small yeah, good to I mean, see you here yeah at last <laughs> finally finally i could get connected with you yeah definitely i must say after lots of efforts it was not uh, it's not a sort of easily happening thing so how are you doing uh yeah i am doing really well but uh, nowadays i am like i have a hectic schedule and i am packed with my office and also uploading videos and yeah it is going well and how are you actually i am familiar with your youtube journey but i don't know much about you what else you do i was inquisitive to know about you reasons uh, i would uh, let you know afterwards and i may say actually i don't know much about it what is the maybe you have some charismatic personality some sort of that stuff so i will uh, let you know everything afterwards first you let me know something about you uh what should i know that i am a i i am mean, like now i am working professional i am doing a job in an ngo sector and i am posted in the hill station in west bengal that is darjeeling and you know that i run a youtube channel and is going well but views are not getting well but it's fine because yeah you know that uh, ups and downs is everywhere so uh, indrajit uh, i would like to just interrupt you uh, i want to use my headphones because your voice is a bit low just wait okay. for a minute okay i can no <laughs> it's much better now it's way better yes i couldn't hear indrajit about the your profession what do you do yeah i am doing a in, job in which sector you do the job in which sector ngo sector ngo ngo yeah like non government organization and okay. i got this job. this is my first job i got this from campus placement okay um, so that's why i joined and i re- i'm really enjoying this because uh, to be honest with you that there is a less stress comparatively it sector and all so i can manage a job and also i can manage my youtube channel and also i can manage my other stuff you handle your youtube channel you are a working professional and you handle other stuff also okay. yeah uh, <laughs> how can you do that lots of things <laughs> in one go yeah actually i have started my youtube channel since 2020 lockdown so uh, initially i was like i was not able to handle this but now i am okay with that and also i can manage my because i am i always try to be disciplined and time management because this is the most important thing in everyone's life i feel that time management managing time so that's how i can manage but somehow sometimes i uh, i can't do but most of the time i try to do that and uh, what about your credentials i like your qualification you are a, you have been a commerce graduate uh, no no i i was i actually i have a btech degree from electronics and engineering B-tech. in electronics and communication engineering but okay. i didn't choose the job especially offered me offered to me because i i have heard about that that this kind of jobs are getting bored over time you will not find any time to relax and that's why i didn't 
want to join there yeah. hmm. and, and uh, what is the kind of what do you do uh, so far as your this ngo sector is concerned non government organization i do understand and what do you actually do uh, the yeah. job profile is we help the needy people to increase their side income as well as in the hill station there is a scarcity of water even drinking water so we provide or we supply the proper amount of drinking water there and also we take care of their health and nutrition level so this kind of activities we do it's a non government organization so then where from this funding comes because everything needs money hmm. so actually uh, there is a, a lot of investors uh, who stayed or who are like in the abroad they they like this pain to nri you may say yeah yeah to take care of this kind of things so that yeah they do lots of funding for ngos various ngos Uh, yeah. I have heard about it. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you belong to West Bengal, and at the moment you are posted at Darjeeling. Yeah, actually I am on a leave right now. I am in home, but I have to go there. Okay. Weather at your place turned bad a day back. You told me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Any problem? one minute hello actually someone yeah. called me okay okay sometimes it happens in between because people are not aware of what kind of stuff we people do <laughs> exactly because sometimes we i don't know what my family members are doing so just call and yeah. then happen. it's a natural it's a natural thing whenever we are on either taking sessions or having this kind of chit chat all of a sudden it starts popping up your call starts popping up <laughs> and when you uh, disconnect the call then after that you have to give so many of the justifications uh, kind of thing that why did i disconnected your call <laughs> yeah. and what do you do ma'am uh indrajit i'm in the arena of education i have been in teaching for so many years but at the moment i'm not in teaching but connected with teaching because at this very moment i'm at the administrative post okay. and i i love to do i love to explore what is happening around me so during this journey i came across this youtube platform i oh. knew it since long uh, i have been knowing it since long but i have i have never explored it earlier you may say that per chance it happened that then may i got to know that uh, we can hone uh, our communication skill or other kind of things or everything is possible on youtube so then slowly and slowly i got diverted towards it so at now these days you may say uh, for the last 5 6 months i am on this journey that i have started working on my communication skill and i why i try to uh, connect with you reason being one thing one reason could be that uh, for the last more about 30 years i have been in uh, contact with the young boys and girls because uh, my institution has always been an institution of higher education not the schools right you got it okay. and i it's a part of my temperament or you may say personality i am not a satisfactory kind of person uh not satisfactory in the sense i believe in learning new and new things whenever i come across mm-hmm. i always remain curious to learn to know about the things so this is one of the reasons that uh, once i got to know about you i saw your some of the channels i saw your some of the these uh, small shots what do you call uh, real kind of mm-hmm. so the, and when i went through the content you post over there this is one of the reasons out of a sudden that curiosity uh, came in my mind that yeah i must talk to this guy 
because i always love to learn from you people from young stuff and for the last one month i i always try to connect with the young boys and girls who are the upcoming youtubers and believe me i always build up that kind of connect that once i uh, have a session with them even after that i don't stop learning from them so whenever i put any request that this is a problem like if i'm editing or i want to know something everyone has come up with the helping hand so that way i am not working on my communication uh, communication skill only i'm learning i'm exploring i'm I, I, and it gives me immense happiness because i live in punjab if you don't have the idea and what we see around us that the youth majority of the youth either they are jobless or they if they get the jobs they don't get the jobs they deserve and you might be familiar with the mass exodus in punjab people every the youth is migrating to the foreign land at you can say uh, innumerable number uncountable number or some of the youth we find they get indulged in wrong kind of practices and you might have heard of drugs and uh, other so much of the stuff and when i see people like you youth like you who are really doing something good for the society good for the society in the sense like you are either doing it for your own growth but when you post these kind of stuff like i got an encouragement from you people that's why i'm here at this very stage also so it always gives me very happiness that this kind of this chunk of youth is also there so i always try to connect with them to know about them i don't and believe me like at this very moment when i am talking you to you i forget about focusing on my words or my language i forget that my purpose is to work on my english frankly speaking your person persona your personality i get totally engrossed into the persona of the other person or the kind of words are coming from his or her mouth so this, this is the thing uh, i'm enjoying and uh, yeah i do i love this kind of thing so that um, this is a reason i was too much into it that yeah at some point of time i thought that the youtubers like you who have good clientele good number of subscribers and very good viewership might be they sometimes reach at that level uh, but you know uh, i i consider uh, at some at, at the different level my purpose to be here is altogether different of course Uh, the hidden agenda is also <clears throat> i found my skills uh, i uh, i was hesitant initially and now it's being decreasing day by day because at a workplace and even at the homes we don't find this kind of environment where we can converse with each other into english but i has always realized that this lacuna is hampering my personality the kind of person i am i am a, if i have to describe myself i am a go getter so today i could succeed because uh, i could succeed in hitting the nail at the right place today and today i have got the opportunity to talk to you to know about you oh awesome awesome what what is help <laughs> that i am lost <laughs> sorry what did you say what you have said i am lost in your oh. speech it <laughs> has delivered oh and now you speak yeah exactly so i would like to know about you that uh, how do you manage youtube and being an ad- administrative work hey? uh, yeah when you have passion for something indrajit then nothing can stop you mm. initially i kept it hidden from my family i have so many of the responsibilities and majority part of my day is spent in the office and my workplace is not in my city it is almost 2 hours drive from my city so that's why i always mention that i am available in the evenings only because my day times they are i am busy with my office work and it takes me about 2 hours to drive and reach home i have responsibilities at my home also because i have three old parents of course i have deputed the staff to take care of them it's my basic duty and uh, my children they are grown up 
but in spite of it if somebody ask me what do i do when i i have free time frankly speaking i don't have any free time but again i'm coming back to answering your question that when you have passion for something like these days i have passion to know about you to work on my skill earlier it was hidden from my family members even now my kids everybody in the family they know about it and everybody supports me a lot like at the moment when i am talking to you my son was sitting over here he was doing his work i said okay beta you just leave me alone i have to go for my session so everybody now cooperates with me everybody is uh, helping me a lot yeah that's really great and you yeah. need join family you can say joint in the sense if children they live with their parents uh, i think it, it's a family it's a complete family i'm living uh, in a complete family good good very good <laughs> yes yes and so and what do you think uh, like the english learners or the beginners who are trying to speak english what they should know or what they should use this kind of things what you do for practicing english actually i have learned from you people indrajit i must say if i have to give credit to anybody of course the lust was inside me because something uh, at least come rises within yourself when you plan when you decide to come up with something okay and uh, as i told you though i have uh, so many if you talk about my my credentials uh, lots of degrees in my credit but having so many degrees don't guarantee guarantee give guarantee to uh, so far your communication skill is concerned because it's all, it's an art it's all together different thing right and I if you that. talk uh, if you ask me what to do i do initially um i took some of the sessions because my journey started from youtube when i came to know that there are some online one to one kind of uh, uh, platform sessions we can have so i took some of the sessions initially then i re- then i start then i stopped it because because of the time constant in my case that was that was a big hurdle and one realization i could get it that it is you only the spirit lies and efforts they are associated with you only platforms can give you encouragement they can help you to some extent to break your hesitation but ultimately you are the person who can help yourself one one can help oneself you you get, got it so uh, then so when what did i started which is still continuing that whenever i'm heading towards my office and i'm coming back i try to create some sort of hypothetical situation around me or whatever i see around me whether it is a weather or a huge traffic on the road i start framing sentences you will see i start talking to myself then in this case then i i have posted one or two or three videos on it also that how do i improve my communication skill but when i realized all of a sudden i got to know that not only the professional the like taking the sessions from professional is the condition i i've seen you people keep chatting with each other one learner is talking to another learner then i started exploring uh, this field also and i started approaching because i always believe i am a learner whatever are my credentials whatever is my status whatever are the number of degrees i have i am at the end of the day i am a learner so i always try to get connected with the different people sometimes some say they respond some of them they don't respond at all but i don't mind it so whenever i am getting opportunity because this way i can increase my time duration to talk yes, yes so this is the thing but ultimately if we are to conclude into three words and that is practice practice and practice that's all there is no other way out no Okay, hundred percent good. And um, it was really lovely to talk to you. And I am amazed to see your spirit at this age, to the enthusiasm. That's awesome. That's like I can't count it. Hope to interact with you in the future also. 
I definitely hope to see you soon, and I will definitely try to make many conversations with you on different topics. But that I really also want that if suppose uh, I have one sitting with somebody, and if I have to go for the second sitting, so I always uh, try to keep this thing in my mind that because. This will again solve our purpose of talking on some particular topic and this way conversing and honing and uh, getting to know more vocabulary words. Yes, yes, so that would definitely help us. So Indrajit, yeah. uh, thank you very much for yeah, sparing yeah. your time. For you, I, if I have to sum it up, I can simply say I am indebted. <laughs>